guys, I hope you're having a great day. My name is Emperor, and in this video, we're going to be talking about the stock price of GameStop. So, the GameStop ticker is a game. Before I begin, I just want to say whatever I say in this video is not financial advice. So, before I begin, I just want to say uh, that whatever I say in this video is not financial advice. So please read the disclaimer and description. So I really must start by saying that in his video on London Investor Tip, a YouTuber channel, Mr. Goldstein, did say that he thought that the price of GameStop was going to rise. Since that video, the price of GameStop has been rising, but a few people did not believe him. Guys, Mr. Goldstein has a very high success rate when it comes to calling it right. Um, as you may know, GameStop is one of those stock that went to the moon in 2021. GameStop rose to $120 from around just $4. Since then, the price of GameStop has been falling. In April 2024, GameStop fell all the way down to just under $10. So the good news is, uh, in May 2025, the price of GameStop rose to around $64. It has since fallen to just under $19 at the lowest point. That massive rise to $64 could be a good sign, guys. It could mean that there are maybe some massive spikes to come. This is what Mr. Goldstein was talking about, guys. Uh, if more and more traders are and investors jump to GME, we could see more massive spikes. GameStop are doing deals. And this could turn out to be good for the GME stock price. I have had a chat with the Mr. Goldstein, and he told me that his target price for GME is $73. I guess we will have to wait to see if he's correct. GameStop still has a big following. Many investors still trade GameStop. I do not know if GameStop price will stay high, if it goes up a lot or, or fall back down. It is important to remind yourself that stock and share can fall as well as rise. This is why some traders short stocks. This means they bet the price to go down. Traders can make money on stocks when they go up and when they go down. GameStop is a stock that could go up a lot, but we have seen it fall a lot as well. Do I like GameStop? I like the idea of owning shares in GameStop for the long term. Many investors in GameStop think that, is, uh, that it has a future. If I was to buy shares in GameStop at this stage, I do not think I could buy them for much lower price. But the thing is, you just never know when the right time is to buy a stock like GameStop. If I decide to buy a GameStop shares, I think I would sell most of the shares after I doubled my money. So I think I see GameStop more of a trade stock than a long-term investment. But I might hold some free shares in GameStop if my double trade make it. You might disagree, but those massive ups and downs scares me, guys. I just cannot help it. I'm afraid of losing money, and before I make any trade or investment, I like to weigh up all the props, pros and cons. GameStops has a lot going for it. I'm sure there are investors that are looking forward to the long future of GameStop, and I hope they make lots of money. Now, if I'm honest, I'm sitting on the fence about investing in GameStop shares. At best, as I said, I might make a long trade to try and double my money and then keep some free GameStop shares. 
Now I'm, I am just looking at so many other stocks, including Neo stock. I have made some videos on Neo stock. Uh, guys, please look at those videos. If you think GameStop is better than Neo stock, please let me know in the comments and let me know why you think it is worth investing in GameStop long term. It is time for me to go now, guys, but if you would like to hear from me in more videos, please uh, leave your, com your feedback in the comments. I read all your comments, all the best in your investing journey, guys. And please, please, please do not forget to like, share, and subscribe. Until next time, bye-bye for now, guys.